Good morning, Riverside High School. Today is Thursday, October 12th, 2023. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Senior portrait retakes are October 27th from 2 to 6 in the afternoon. Please see Mrs. Ewan to sign up and get information. Makeup school picture day is scheduled for October 23rd. If you missed picture day or need to schedule retakes, please come to the main office to sign up. If you have not yet received your student ID or there is a mistake on your ID, please sign up. The Diversity Club will meet today at 2 o'clock in the library. The Chess Club will meet today at 2 o'clock in room 227. If you would like to attend the sophomore trip to Baltimore, Maryland next April but haven't yet brought in your deposit, please bring it in as soon as possible to room 108. We will be finalizing the roster by the end of the week. Your second deposit of $125 is not due until December 1st. Any questions, please see Ms. Quiring or Mr. Vanskyver. Homecoming shirts for the class of 2026 are now available to pre-order. There's an example on Google Classroom and the actual shirt can be seen in room 108. Homecoming shirts are $15 and can be ordered in room 108. All orders and money for shirts are due to Ms. Quiring by Monday, October 16th. Homecoming float building is underway and will be held tonight from 6 to 8.30. Only Riverside High School students may attend and you must have your school issued ID in order to enter. No ID, no entrance. Tickets will be on sale today through the 18th for homecoming dance. They will not be sold after Wednesday the 18th. The cost is $15 per person and can be purchased in room 222 after school. Payment must be in cash. The dance is October 21st from 7 to 9.30. Any questions, see Mrs. Hunter in room 222. If you're bringing a guest from another high school to homecoming, you must get the form from the main office and return it completed to Ms. Hunter in room 222 by the end of the day on Friday, October 13th. If you do not submit a completed form by this date, your guest will not be permitted to attend the dance. Senior homecoming shirts are ready to be ordered. Shirts are $18 each. See Mr. Stellwag or Mrs. Garvin to place your order. Althea the therapy dog will be visiting the high school on October 17th and October 24th. Students are able to sign up in the guidance office prior to the start of the program. The I'm Possible Project is a suicide prevention and anti-bullying program with guest speaker Joshua Rivdell. Mr. Rivdell will be educating students and staff about youth mental health. Students in grades 9 through 12 will participate in an assembly on October 18th, 2023. Staff will be trained on November 1st. Students who want to show their support for students who are bullied or don't have a voice to receive help are invited to participate in a day of silence on Thursday, October 26th, 2023. Students will remain silent for the day and wear a black shirt. Students interested in participating pay $1 and receive a wristband. All donations go to the Diversity Club. On Wednesday, November 1st, the ASFAB will be administered at Riverside High School. If you are interested in joining the armed services, you should consider registering for the test. The test is open to all sophomores, juniors, and senior students and the test is free. Please sign up in guidance office by Friday, October 27th. In Ram Sports yesterday, the boys soccer team fought to a double overtime tie with Bordentown. Jason Younga netted the lone goal for the Rams while Anthony Stillwagon recorded nine saves. The girls soccer team lost to Maple Shade and the field hockey team was defeated by Audubon despite a goal from Evie Ara. The only sports action today is in the Pop Vernon Fieldhouse as the girls volleyball teams take on the St. Joe's Hamilton. JV will begin at 345 with varsity to follow. For this Holloway season, everyone is getting into the Halloween spirit, even SeaWorld. They will have a special walkthrough attraction with zombies, clowns, and witch doctors with full cast interaction 
starting on, ironically, Friday the 13th. If you live close to one, definitely check out this attraction. Live sea animals are said to be used in it as well, though interaction with said animals is forbidden. People can also sign up to assist with the attraction and become one of the scare actors. Sign-ups are on their website if you or anyone you know who lives close to a SeaWorld is interested. Israel continued its efforts to retrieve hostages taken in the weekend attacks by Hamas. A special envoy sent by the United States arrived in Israel to begin talks to have American, citizen, American citizens taken hostage returned. The Phillies moved one game closer to returning to the National League Championship Series last night with a 10-1 victory over the visiting Braves. Game time for Game 4 is set for 8.07 tonight. The weather today calls for sunny skies with clouds arri arriving late. Highs will be in the low 70s with lows in the upper 50s. Happy birthday to Elizabeth Ramos. That's all for today. Thanks for stopping by. Make sure to click that little bell to subscribe. We look forward to seeing you tomorrow. I really hope our yearbook turns out like this this year. Right? I love the layout. And I love that color. But why would I want to buy a yearbook? Because it's a historical book. And you can remember all the fun events throughout the year? For the memories. Okay, but it's $65. And that's because yearbooks are forever. Make sure you order the 2024 Torch for $65 by October 27th at johnstonsyearbook.com or make sure you see Ms. Ewan in room 223. <laughs>